Here's an ePortfolio tutorial. Create and sample plans. Forward planning. This video will guide you through the process and explain how to create a sample plan for ePortfolio as an internal verifier. Assumptions. You have access to ePortfolio. You are an internal verifier. If you are a multi-role user, you have selected the internal verifier from the active role menu. You wish to create a sample plan. Log into ePortfolio. From the home screen, select View Sample at right, which is located and Overview. You are now on the Sample Plan screen. This screen will list previously created or not yet completed sample plans. To create a new sample plan, click Create Sample at top right. You will be brought to the Sample Plan Details screen. The following information is available. Title, name given to the sample plan, date of sample, the date you intend to conduct the sample, comments, you are able to make notes, description relating to the sample plan, i.e. what you intend to discuss or carry out during the meeting. Assessment methods, you have the following options, guided discussion, learner statement, observation, other, product evidence, questioning, Witness testimony or all. Assessors, learners. This is where you will select the assessor and or the learners who you wish to sample their work. Qualifications. This is where you specify which qualification you wish to sample. Start by adding a title. Then add the sample date. This can be set for a future date. Forward planning. Add a comment or description, then select the assessment method. Next, select the assessor. For the purpose of this video, we will not select an assessor, so we'll click cancel. And now, select the learners. Again, we will not select a learner for this video. By not selecting an assessor or learner, you will sample across all of the assessors and learners that you are associated with. This is the default setting. Next, click on Add Assessments to Sample Plan at bottom right. Select the relevant piece of evidence by placing the tick in the box at left. Alternatively, you can select all by clicking the tick box at top left. Next, click Add. You will notice that the evidence is now linked to the sample plan. Click Submit at bottom right. You are now back on the sample plan screen. The sample plan you have just submitted will be listed and shows the following information. The title, IV plan date, this is the date you selected to carry out the sample. Created, this is the date you created the sample plan. Sampled, progress bar which displays the current progress of your sample. It is based on the amount of assessments within your plan. If you hover over the progress bar, the following information is displayed. Let's click on the home icon at the top of the page. Under tasks, you will see the sample plan that you've just created, which includes the date you will be carrying this out. 